For my interactive system designs assignment at RMIT, I created a patch that uses audio manipulation to move the Z axis on a 3D mesh and also changing eye colors due to the sound exceeding a specific threshold. I created this patch with the idea of it being added to live gigs as a visual display that can be used on a musician's face and can use the audio in real time to create an interesting effect. So the patch works as follows. Uh, with this option here, you click open and you get the option to pick something off your desktop in terms of an mp3 uh, and then it is loaded into the patch uh, then you click resume and the display will start to kick in The way this patch works is using the webcam on a computer it is fed through the jit.grab JIT which grabs the nearest uh, available webcam and feeds it through a uh, Luma um, object which then turns the image to grayscale which allows for this displacement to occur as the mesh works with the lightest points coming out the furthest on the z-axis and the darkest points staying further behind so as you can see uh, parts such as my t-shirt and my nose have come out the furthest as well as my forehead uh, whereas my jumper has sort of stayed more towards the back through this integer box here I'm able to control how far I want the z-axis to come out so in this case I can put it right up to something ridiculous like that or in the negatives make it go back but because I like the way it sits with three being the most it can come out um, I tend to keep it with generating a random number between one and three from the bang that is triggered here um, using the music input as, dem as shown before uh, the sound is fed through a live gain object then into a meter which turns it into a numeric value and um, once the sound peaks I've got it here as 50 um, it sends a bang and through this bang it changes it triggers the displacement of the mesh to change as well as the eye colors changing also so if I put this back to zero you can see that once the bang is triggered random numbers are generated in accordance to the music this allows for the imagery of my display to look as if it's moving to the music and um, I think it could be a great tool for live bands with you know a simple camera and a screen of some sort to create a visual aspect to their performances